The Ereskin Dayan Shevya Memorial Youth Choir Workshop was founded in 2022 and has been bringing choir members together from throughout our diocese for the purpose of teaching them the Ekmali and Badarak in four-part harmony. This program was founded in memory of Yeres Hindayan Shevian, who was the wife of Father Mardiro Shevian, the dean of the seminary. And Yeres Hindayan was involved throughout her life in many capacities in our church choirs, whether it was being on the executive board of the choir association, or being a youth choir director herself, or a longtime choir member. Every single day uh, we meet uh, with our respect respective sections and we just like go over the parts for the Badarak that we have to know and we're able to learn like uh, as, as a tenor so I learn all the tenor and bass lines and we just get to sing and practice together and prepare for rehearsals and for Badarak. My favorite part of the choir workshop is the choir rehearsal because we get to sing in harmony all together. The tones and the history of different melodies, it's really fascinating to see the questions the students have that they come up with and the way that they really just engage with a, a deeper understanding of not just what we're singing any given week, but why we sing the sing things that we sing the meaning they have both as part of the service but also musically and where that history and tradition comes from is really just beautiful to see. It's something that I love learning more about even as a counselor and it's fantastic to see the growth of that deeper understanding and appreciation of the musical history behind our Badanatma. Workshop serves as a beautiful opportunity for our Armenian youth to build in the body of Christ, learn our liturgical hymns, and grow in love for Christ as well, and create a sense of community. And I think that's the most beautiful thing, seeing pe young people from different parts of America come together and join in harmony to sing glory to our Lord. I just want to say 
Uh, the thing I like the most about this conference is probably singing in the chapel, especially because our voices are able to bounce off the walls and the harmonies come together and it's really nice when it all comes together and when we finish a hymn and it sounds really nice. So. I think my favorite part of St. Nipsis so far has been the meditation. It's really nice at night to just have like a moment of reflection. Plus it's really nice being with the whole group where it's kind of just this moment of peace and reflection with my fellow um, choir workshop friends. Everybody comes together and everybody sings and like we all get into this mood that we're together and we're here to serve God but also it's not just that sure like we're here to serve God and like that's super important but it's also like we're meeting new people and when we're serving God with those people it feels a lot more important. seeing that they're able to express themselves through their faith, through their voices, and see that they can harmonize with other youth from across the Western and Eastern Diocese, and now build relationships that would last a lifetime, and be able to just, when they come into the chapel, just hearing them seeing from the outside, you know the future is, is here, the future is now, they're going to be our future leaders, and we're seeing it now, it's not something you know, that's unheard of. It's, you're actually hearing it now, and like when they're seeing in the chapel. So it's, it's beautiful. It's beautiful and it's lovely to see. I truly believe that Yedis and Diane would be so proud of the hard work that's being put in by our participants, as well as the enthusiasm that they bring to serving their church and glorifying God. <laughs> 